Let us bless the Lord. Thank you, Lord. My name is Ashwin. I am studying in 8th standard. My house is in Katapana. Currently, I am studying in Don Bosco, Venala. Studying means boarding, but attend a school outside called St. Vincent. I am also learning guitar and I like it. I am Nidhin. I am from Calicut. Don Bosco is a home away from home for me. I have 60 friends here. We get up at quarter to 6 a.m. every day. Some of us are lazy to get up, but there is a brother who is ever present with us. We start the day with Sadhagam, the Carnatic music practice. We take turns to serve at the Mass. This is not a parish, but a private chapel. A small chapel is packed every day. They say that an added incentive for them to come to a church for Mass is the singing of our children. After the Mass, we have some time to study. We have more time in the evening after bath. We clean our own premise. We have a small garden. Some prepare notice boards. A good way to show their artistic talents. Some work in the study hall. Refectory. We are told cleanliness is next to godliness. I think these simple things help us to pick up some practical skills. So now we have Tomin, the organic farmer, Don, the electrician, Lucos, the guest master, Ebin, the artist. The breakfast is followed by some morning chores. As I told you, we study in a school not far from where we stay. Back in the evening, we have games. It is also the time when music teachers come to teach us musical instruments. All of us are part of Don Bosco band and learn chenda, the typical drum of Kerala. Don Bosco Music Academy is affiliated to Trinity College of Music. We appear for grade exams. Some of us are just beginners, while some have even completed 8th grade when they passed out from Don Bosco. Gichu Chetan is our senior. While studying here, he attended the International Mozart Piano Competition in Italy and won the 4th place. Later on, he was trained in Florence. Now he teaches us piano. We have 8 teachers for different instruments. The students are taught one instrument or another depending on their interest and aptitude. We have our study time in the evening. Either a priest or a brother is always present with us. We always have their guidance and support. We are a family. Don Bosco used to tell us, love the boys and let them know that they are loved. We assist these children in their early stages of preparation for life. Years later, when they returned to the institution as young men, some with their families, we feel really happy and satisfied in our mission among these children, who were considered very ordinary. Quite a number of them have become priests in the diocese as well as different religious congregations, including Salishan congregation. This time when I went home, my parents told me that they see a lot of change in me. I never used to do any work at home. But now, when I visit home, I help my parents. I do the gardening, wash my own clothes, prepare my own bed. I think that's what they call a change. Before I came here, I was scared to appear in the public. I don't know how to speak to the elders. But now, the things are different. I feel that I can do a lot of things. I have improved my English. The person who plays keyboard in my parish is a pastor of Don Bosco. It is actually he who inspired me to join here. We also have recreation time. 
in the evening after dinner we spend a time together the main subject of the conversation is what happened that day usually at school then we break up into groups for our daily rosary after the rosary the students have a short night prayer followed by a small piece of good thought we call it good night talk it's a practice started by mama margaret don bosco's mother she wanted the children to go to bed with good thought in their mind i never used to brush my teeth before going to bed this is another thing that i started doing after reaching don bosco we are not supposed to talk in dormitory or washing days and study hard there is no excuse for this thing i have to go now soon the life will be over Let us bless the Lord. Thank you.